So you might be trying to figure out how you can share your ETA on your iPhone. Now, you have to be on iOS 17 in order to do this, at least with the method that I'm showing you. So if you're not on iOS 17 yet, then just kind of forget this video. But if you are, or by the time you're watching this, you're doing this, then to do this, what you want to do is you want to open up your iMessage settings just like so. And you want to go and make your way over to this little panel, just like on your iMessage thing right here. Now, what you want to do here is you want to go and click on the plus button. And what you're going to want to do is you want to swipe down until you see a little option that says, so what check-in is going to do is it's going to go ahead and allow you to basically check into these specific people. And it's going to allow you that when, as soon as you go ahead and get into a certain area, you're going to basically be able to go ahead and check in with them when you get your you know, specific estimated time of arrival. Now, if you want to instead share, if you don't want to do the check-in thing, you can also go ahead and share your ETA by using Apple Maps, Google Maps, whatever you want to do. So the thing I like about check-in is that they'll basically be able to see any changes or anything. That's kind of the big thing I kind of like. But if you don't want to do that, you can always go into an application like Apple Maps, for example. And if you were to have the directions pulled up like this, you can always go and take a screenshot of this and send it over to somebody. But what you can also do is go into this specific panel. You can go into details. And if you want, you can also share this specific panel without with somebody else by scrolling down over to the share button right here. And you can share this specific page to somebody else. So you can click here. You can share via AirDrop. You can, I guess, there's no way to send it via screenshot. But that's another option that you have. I do think that the check-in method is probably a little bit better, but this is also a decent option that you have too, that you probably have on Google Maps or Apple Maps as well. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out. Till then.